Hey guys, right in front of me are packages I got from eBay. Uh, my mom made a PayPal account and I decided, hey, I'm going to put those handheld Yahtzees up on eBay and, um, yeah, I mean, where else can you get the money for handheld Yahtzees? I mean, I got like four of them. I can get like 10, 15 bucks each for it. So I started doing that. I got some money. And then I got, you know what, I, I was thinking, you know what, I got all these accessories, like, I have like 10 NES controllers. I don't need 10 NES controllers. So I only need like a, like four at most. So I started um, selling some extra controllers and stuff that I don't need. I mean, uh, I don't have a tube TV. I can't use a zapper. So you know what? In case that I'll keep one or two. I mean, every deal I make, I keep some excess stuff. And it all adds up, you know. So um, I started selling some of those and I got some... Uh, on this website, it, there were some uh, good deals that pop up on eBay, and uh, I started to get some good stuff. But let's start off with some stuff I got a week ago, the stuff that I started buying on eBay. But, um, yeah, I'll show you guys that. And some stuff I got in the mail today. So, um, I'll tell you a good story. Uh, when I was younger, I played Pokemon. I was a Pokemon nut, okay? And I had every single Pokemon game, nearly. Um, but I actually kept all the Pokemon boxes. I used to put them in this, uh, this closet we had that we kept all the electronics into. Put it right on the shelf right there. And, and I didn't even look at the manual or anything. I just put it right there, took the cartridge out. And you know what? I didn't even read the manual or look at the inserts. So all the boxes were basically untouched maybe once or twice touched and all of them were mint, Pokemon yellow, Pokemon blue, red, fire red, leaf green, emerald, sapphire, ruby, you know, all the and and uh, my mom um, she's got cameras and take up a lot of space like the big ones and uh, we need some more room and they threw it out I'm pretty sure about that because I can't find it anywhere but hopes up um, but I decided to buy uh, some myself for the sentimental value so let's get right into it the one that means the most to me in this whole lot has to be the Pokemon yellow it's my favorite Pokemon uh, first gen game because you can get all the starters you know and yeah Pikachu follow you around and I just love it I believe I got this for 35 bucks. I did not get the game. I already had the game. So I put my copy in. Box is in pretty good shape. Um, you know, it comes with all the inserts and the manual. So I just want to get a piece of my childhood back. So we got that. Another game I got. Was uh, Pokemon Leaf Green. The box is in alright shape. It's acceptable. You know, um, if I find a better box, I'll trade it. But I think I won an auction for $36 total. And it actually came complete with the cartridge. So I think that was worth it. And it came with the adapter, which I actually never used. And I didn't even touch it um, when I originally got it. And the cartridge was in basically mint condition. And it comes with the inserts. The Game Boy Player insert. And the, all the manuals and poster. So I think I paid a good price for that. The last game, I can't find the original box. I got it from eBay. from the, I got the original styrofoam and stuff, but... Um, I got Pokemon Silver. I think this this is just box and all the stuff inside only. And the box is in amazing shape. I mean, it's pretty much immaculate except for a crease right here, and that's it. So the front is really good. Um, again, I put my copy of the game inside of it. I think I paid thirty four total for the box and everything inside, but you know it's it's all good because it means a lot to me. It's so sentimental to me that when 
I, um, you know, I traded in Pokemon Emerald and all the Pokemon again at GameStop, and I heard the Pokemon Emerald theme for the first time in six years. I actually cried because it was so sentimental to me. So this is stuff I got today in the mail, and um, it's my mom's PayPal, and she opened the packages. Uh, I didn't open, but I didn't look inside, but I. I kind of peeked at one of them because it was an envelope, and I'm not showing you the front because it's got my address. And I used that site, and I got some good deals and some stuff I really needed. Oh yes, oh yes. What is this? Oh, that's nothing. Okay. So that I really needed this, guys. You can already tell, but. It's the Albert Odyssey. This is the insert and back art. All right, hold on. Let me show you guys. Where is it? All right, here it is. This is my original copy. All right. <laughs> um, it's in this little case, and I desperately needed the insert and back art so I could put in a regu regular case. And make it look awesome. So, I already have the disc. My disc, look at this. It's in mint condition, not a single light scratch. So, I cannot wait to put that on my shelf. Damn. And I've not opened this package yet, so it'll be a total surprise to me. Because I have games awaiting in the mail, so I have no idea what it is. Oh! Oh my god, yes, yes, yes! Yes! Okay, so this was a recent buy it now. I got a really good price on... Oh my god, this case is in amazing shape. I got pretty lucky. Um, I paid $60 for this game. Oh my god. This is great. This is fantastic. This case is immaculate. Oh my god. Oh my god. So sixty dollars for this game, I think it normally goes for like one forty. So I mean this is pretty good. A few light light scratches, but that's it. And that's it. I'll show you the manual now. I already had this game, but I just I, I couldn't pit map uh pit it up. Passed it up for sixty dollars. Um, I was afraid it would have gone in a reseller's hand because, I mean, a lot of good deals pop up on eBay and a lot of people buy them. I check them out in their resellers. So I snagged this for sixty dollars, free shipping on eBay. So I'm totally happy about that. It's just I'm so excited. I mean, two copies of, of one of the most valuable games on the Sega Saturn. Just, Oh, and I could I'm um, I could probably trade this for a rare RPG. I could probably trade it for Earthbound. I mean, if any of you guys want this game, uh, I could probably trade it for Earthbound or you know something of that nature. Speaking of Earthbound, I almost got one on eBay for a hundred. It was in pretty good shape. Buy it now, and I was just a milliseconds away. I mean, when I clicked on the the link, it was still available. But when I I like hesitate for a little bit. Oh. I'm I'm kicking myself in the butt for doing that because, I mean, if I didn't hesitate, you know, I kind of, you know, um, I went to go to click to pay from PayPal, you know, I was like, I was just thinking about it and just, ugh. so I'll see you guys in the next episode. I got some more stuff coming in. Um, so see you guys.